Guys, right off Chinatown, which is essentially, I think, like right over there, maybe to the right, is this area. I don't know what it's called, but you can see you got some homelessness. And uh, I was just kind of making my way around here last night, just um, just exploring. I was staying close to the train station in, I think it's Kuala Lumpur. And this is maybe a four minute walk from there. So I was just walking around and I, um, what I noticed was there are all these chairs, like those women were sitting right there. And there are women sitting just kind of right in this section here. And just kind of a girl every maybe 40 feet or so. And um, I think they're all prostitutes. So you got this hotel here, rather nice hotel. And then, you know, they weren't they weren't really talking to people, they were just sitting and waiting and pulling from my past experiences, um, exploring Bangkok, I've, you know, I noticed that there'd be this trend where you'd have these girls who'd sit in plastic chairs and then later, just through talking to local people, I'd learn yeah, they, they, those are prostitutes. That's what they, they're just sitting and uh, waiting for a, uh, uh, a customer, essentially. So, it's pretty weird and interesting. When you walk around these sections, when you don't really know what you're seeing, but you know something's up and uh, just decoding the, the just decoding it a bit. That's what it seems to have been. Just prostitutes in uh, in Bangkok on the street, street hookers, I guess you call them. So it's uh. There's lots of layers and facets of Bangkok, for sure. And if you're a visitor, you don't really know what you're getting yourself into or what you're seeing. It takes a bit of time to uncover and understand what's happening. That being said, let's go. Uh, I gotta find where the train station is. Gotta figure this out.